um, hey Nerfkin99 here with, um, a video on how to make a speed loader. Uh, I think I just one more for someone I can show you. This is a speed loader. So, it's basically one barrel glued on top of the other, then e tape over it. So, it looks nice. So, what you do, load stuff in here, load one in here. Fire your gun, flip it around, prime it again, and fire. That way, excuse me, you don't have to reload again. So, you need CPVC. This is Genova. It's really nice. This is just a blank, it's a dud. So, it fits nice. Um, you'll need your hot glue gun with hot glue. Um, Dremel or sharp scissors. My Dremel, I don't have a bit small enough to sand it, so I'll, I will be using wire cutters just to. Yep. Yeah. Oh, and sandpaper is also recommended. And pencil and ruler. So, what you do is you measure your CPVC. I'm using 4 inch barrels. This is pretty close to 4 inches. Probably can't see that. That didn't matter. Four inches of CPVC. Then you want to glue these together. Oh, and I don't have very much hot glue right now. So. So, yeah, just spread it out, and it, I'm using a high temp, so it, the hot glue kind of spreads out all on its own, which is convenient. Don't want the little strands of hot glue. It's really fun. Alright. Oh, yeah, Steph K2 is here. Say hi. Oh, hi! Sorry, trying to cut. <laughs> Couldn't figure out what he said. <laughs> he was just looking at me, and I was looking at him going, what? Alright, so, that's all cut. Uh, it's drying. It's pretty close. Being done. Uh, oh, yeah, I forgot that part. Um... Electrical tape is also recommended, so it looks nice. I think I said that in the beginning, though. Alright, so, that's all dry. Now flip it over and glue the other side. gonna want about a four to five inch speed loader for like a night finder or something but for a long shot like a 12 10 to 12 so something like that. with a k26 yeah with a k26 do i don't have one i need something to push out to more pop. sorry trying to find something
Her barrel is gonna wanna, going to want to be a little longer than this. speed it up is putting hot water on it. Nope. Cold water. Sorry. Nope. <laughs> we have a bloopers video of that e-tape update and well it's not an actual video but we shot one and he he was going to add another one called the Sniper Kid 2. Yeah Sniper Kid 2 is going to add another one of uh the, the triangle of the electrical tape, and, and I was like, nope, and it was pretty funny. Yeah, and then he was all, that's the end of the video, he didn't say, nope, because that would be pretty dumb. No, I didn't say no, because it would be dumb, I just, no, I said, he didn't say that, he didn't give me an answer, it's just a plain, nope. So... for many things. You can have this, add the coupling right there over your gun, put a hand cap right there, and it might work, actually. It would work just very, very well. Very well. Efficient transferring. So, there is your speed loader. Oh, and this may not be the cleanest speed loader no, right now, it's but... it's actually pretty bad. By my standards. So uh, there it is, all glued together. It's not the That's best. it, and I'm going to wrap electrical tape, wrap it in electrical tape, and I'll be... Alright, so back here, uh, a E-tape e wrap speed loader. So, what you do is take two seven darts, or three mine, um, put it in one end, then another. Putting that in. So what you do, prime your gun, uh, take aim and fire, flip it around, prime it, take aim and fire. That way you don't have to reload twice. Very convenient for wars. Um, it loads suckers. Uh, streamline, just push it in there. Push that in there. And yeah, you're ready to go. In? In? You're ready to go. Tub. <laughs> Alright, so, thank you for watching, rate, comment, and subscribe.